take but people don't tell you it's easy they say it's okay people don't tell you it's easy to start a business it's easy i'm not gonna it's easy but it's a lot of work it's easy but it's a lot of work and why i say it's easy is because you can easily go and find a vendor you can easily go and get stuff to make products like you can easily go and do those things and then you can easily go set you up a website it's easy it's free and then with the first month normally be like a dollar if you're using shopify so let's get into this talk so why i say it's multiple businesses you can start and what i mean by that It's crazy because <laughs> I got this plastic on this, on this, um, my lip gloss. And this is just the one I'm using because it's leaking. It's like leaking, but why I say it's easy you can start a business. You can start multiple business on doing anything. Like right here, this is um, one of my lip glosses, mm. um, which this, I don't even know the name of it yet, but it smells so freaking good. And just look at it. Like, but you can easily get a lip gloss, make you some lip gloss, start your lip gloss line, right? Set your own prices. You can easily do that, right? Like I said, I have actually multiple colors i got this new color i even got my logo on it um i actually this is this i had it wrapped up in plastic but you can easily like i said make you this one this one is a pink color but it comes on cute too as well i get y'all do the shades and stuff tomorrow so y'all can really see um you can easily do that. If you don't want to do lip gloss, guess what you can do? Start your lip uh, eyelash business. You can do eyelashes. People still wear eyelashes. If you don't want to sell strip eyelashes, guess what you can do? You can get you a vendor that do individual eyelashes, right? They do. They have individuals. You don't want to do individuals, then you can get your vendor that has um, the lashes that people, you know, the individuals that people actually do now that cost with seventy five dollars, depending on who you go to or more, but to get your eyelashes done, you can do that. These are mine. These going on my website, right? So you can do that. That's two, look two business right there. You don't want to do lashes. You could do lip gloss. You don't want to do lip gloss? You could do lashes, right? All right. That's two. And not even just that. It's just like people, people have said, or well, I'm not going to say people have said, people have shown that they've made six figures and more just by selling lashes, just by selling lip gloss. These are never going out of style people are always gonna need some lashes people are always gonna need some lip gloss come on now like people are always gonna need a nude <laughs> people are always gonna need a clear so if you just want to start your business and just do clear lip gloss different type of clear lip glosses do that you want to start your business and do different type of news do that if you want to do clear and new both together do that let me tell you it's too much money out here for people not to be trying to start or do anything they sell it's too much free money out here that people could be making people don't tell you how easy it is people want to people want to be selfish i'm telling you people want to be selfish not even just that yanni bars right they're in style heavenly they're in style like these are like i'm seeing these everywhere nowadays people making these days sales 
let's let's get into it let's tap into our entrepreneurship ladies like you could just sell these make you a little six figures like get into it get into it not even that okay body soap this is oatmeal i have a um i got another one but this is just um the oatmeal you can you see a lot of kids babies with eczema look i went down to florida this past month and i gave this to my nephew to use on his whole body because he got eczema so it worked because he was just like oh my soap he was using that soap every day clearing his skin and I, yes you could do this for people who got eczema you could just sell this by itself or you could sell these together and call it a day too many bit look this is one business if you just want to do lashes that's two businesses if you just want to sell this that's three if you want to do all three together do you know how much money you can make more than six figures <laughs> right you sell all this together that's more than six figures right there right all right not even just this i even have a um turmeric bar i'm gonna show you guys later on um when i come back on here tomorrow right so i even have a turmeric bar for your face to clear dark marks right people use that people who break out a lot all that now y'all know i told you i don't break out that much but i still use that sometimes on my face i even have another face wash that i've been using on my face with black it's black soap and something else natural that business business like we can tap into our entrepreneurship if you don't know how to make stuff you can google it youtube it <laughs> youtube it and google it it is so many ways to be honest to start a business not even just that like i said not even just a turmeric soap if you want to do it by yourself because everybody into that face routine right like i said not even just that let me um other ways to start a business and i'm, I'm opening up my phone so y'all can see other ways you can go to aliexpress right you can go to AliExpress, right? You can, t t to be honest, you can find anything on AliExpress and Alibaba. If you just say, I'm trying to think of something right now. I got this robe on and this robe is from Jada Collection, right? I got this shirt on and this shirt is from Jada Collection. I got these house shoes on, and it's from Jada Collection, right? All right, so say if y'all shop with Jada, y'all know she never restock on out of stock <laughs> sizes. When she always say she restocking, it's never a size medium she restocking. It's never a size small, it's never a size large. It's only sizes that she have left which it's never a medium it's never a small and it's never a large right okay pinpoint this she comes out with different collections it's never the same thing right boom okay one thing i know that is and i was just telling my friend this the other day let me get a sip of water hold on all right one thing I was just telling my friend is that I work with, I said, somebody, I said somebody, and it, it could be, it might be me, it might, I said might, but somebody can find a vendor who sells, get, get this kicker. Anything on her website that somebody wants. So say her most popular item on her website is the thermal sets, right? Short sleeve or long sleeve. 
somebody can take that picture of the thermoses, right? I'm I'm hippie all on game. This is this is per game. Take that picture of that of that um the thermoset that she has on her website. You can go to Alibaba. You can go to let me show let me show y'all the apps. You can go to Alibaba or AliExpress. <sighs> All right, y'all. So welcome back to my channel. So as y'all know, this is like a pickup off from the video that it cut short <laughs> because my phone died. But um, what was I saying? So we're gonna pick a backup off of um doing aliexpress and alibaba so like i was saying um <laughs> but like i was saying so it's plenty of ways you can start a business so what i was saying on before i got cut off i was saying that you can take a picture or get a picture of basically anything that you want to start your business on whether it's clothes it's hair bunnies hair ties lashes like anything so everybody already know about aliexpress everybody already know about alibaba right so you can easily gotta pull it back up right <laughs> Don't mind that crack. Oh, I hate it. All right. So, like I said, you can easily get a picture. And I was, for example, what I was doing from the last video, I was saying that um, before I got cut off, I was saying, say if, like, Jada Way to her thermosets, she never restocks on those thermosets. So, I was saying, you can take a picture of that thermoset, go to Alibaba. Go to Alibaba. Go to Alibaba. I'm going to try to show it on, um, on here. I'm going to try to screen record it and show it on here. Um, and kind of like show you guys. But I'm going to see if um, basically it will show on this. Alibaba. You can go to Alibaba. Put the picture into this. This little picture thing right <laughs> um you can just let's say you maybe want to do body scrub or something body scrub boop say you want to um start your body scrub business right I like, like i did this i put the body scrub picture in alibaba and like i said it shows vendors who has that same color color of body scrub that I just put in there or similar to those colors. But it shows you all the vendors, the prices, how much it'll be, um, everything. It shows you how many people bought from it. It gives you the reviews. You could do that, it's not a business. Let me say, hmm, I'm gonna click on this wholesale vendor right here. The price is, is from $2.69 to $3.49. And the shipping per pieces is $1.99. But the minimum order that you have to place is 100 pieces. Now, that is like the downside of Alibaba that I hate. Is that you, a lot of the vendors on there, you have to do an order quantity. Like you have to buy a certain amount of pieces to basically put in an order with them. So I'm gonna click on this vendor because they are verified, right? <sighs> they are verified. They have two orders. Um, I'm gonna look at the they store reviews. So all their reviews looks good except One of them I see, it says, save your money, horrible customer service, and product is not consistent. So that probably means that 
not all the product is the same every time they order so it changes mm. you kind of I mean that's just one review right okay here go another one i ordered two times from this company the first time i dealt with carita and the customer service and product was great my second order was with maya this time around and the communication was horrible i asked for the same product as my last order and was promised that i would receive the same item and production would be 10 days products took more than 10 days when i asked for updates i got a different excuse every time the communication the customer service was horrible i paid for gold foil lettering within a day of opening the product the gold foil is peeling off the bottle the quality of product is not the same as my previous order and the packaging was not the same either when i complained about these things i got offered no solution do yourself a favor and do not order from these people or work with Maya on your orders. I am highly disappointed that I spent my money with these people. All right. So, two bad reviews, all right? But you can go through and you can actually, like I said, there's plenty of vendors on here that you can actually go through and choose from to start a business, right? So, this is, to be honest my opinion <clears throat> if you're gonna use alibaba to get products i would say get you a little sample which the samples are normally like i said cheap two dollars three dollars get you a little sample use that sample if you want to put a logo on it to try it out too put your little logo on it whatever try it out with that sample before you go and put in a big order with that sample if you want to go through with that business on that product then you should basically um like i said take pictures in it do videos on it post them um that if that's if that's only what you want to go with don't get it and then try to post and then that's not what you want to go with right so if you oh my hair is just it's acting crazy right now okay so like i said take pictures and videos and that's what you want to rock with with the logo on it if it's good quality um anything that you use on alibaba before you try to set you up a website and go with the products and get all the inventory in you don't want to waste your money on inventory now a lot of things I have been hearing um, when starting a business, and I think it's a good idea too. And I probably should have went with that, but I mean, I didn't pay much on my stuff, and so I'm good, and I make some of my stuff too. Is basically to um, do like a pre-order, make your website with the pictures and videos and stuff that you have, and you know, of course promote it and stuff and then come back do a website with pre-orders and before you when you launch before you buying all that inventory then you have those pre-orders so let them know pre-orders you know that you're not going to be able to ship out until maybe a month later two or three weeks from now a week from now whenever see how many orders you get first before you try to get all that product because then you're gonna be like me and have product just product just sitting and then it's like okay <laughs> you know so i will say that is one thing i did um i did kind of like hear it and kind of took opinion of so i was like okay that's a good idea never thought of that right okay so that's alibaba another way you can do it Alibaba, L -A -L oh, my necklace is backwards. Why y'all ain't telling me this? Ooh. All right, so another one, right? AliExpress. Now, AliExpress, like I said, AliExpress and Alibaba, are, they still are two things that you have to be careful with, right? So AliExpress is... I love AliExpress. AliExpress got their ups and downs, but to be honest, I love AliExpress, right? So a lot of girl, a lot of you girlies know using AliExpress, you get you get your hair, you get your little weave and stuff from AliExpress. You find some good weave on there. If you want to start a hair business, 
vendors <laughs> you got some vendors on the aliexpress like the look gems like people don't tell you this okay vendors all right aliexpress to me is about the same thing as alibaba you take your pic you, <clears throat> you can take your picture right <sighs> oh oh hold on take your picture you can take your picture in that album let me find that body scrub. Take your picture, right? Body scrub. Well, <laughs> that didn't pop up right how I um wanted it to. But to be honest, it did pop up some um some body scrub in here, and not only that, it popped up some bath bombs too. So if you like I said, if you want to start a skincare business or anything, then you go AliExpress, right? Not even just that. If you don't even know what you want to go and sell, go on AliExpress and just look. Like if you wanna, kid you not, y'all. I'm, I'm gonna let you let hip y'all on this. You wanna sell any type of jewelry, bracelets, sunglasses. You can you can see how many people bought from that vendor. My biggest thing is with AliExpress, if you want to like sell things from there and get things from there and you find products on there, you don't want to get a vendor who has maybe two, three, four, five orders because you like, uh, it's not enough reviews on there to actually know how that product is, right? Okay, so um, you kind of want to, you don't want to get somebody who got maybe 10,000, 20,000, 100,000 um, buys off there because you know that's a popular item. Everybody probably already got it, right? So you kind of want to, let's see, do 200, 300, find somebody that got 200, 300 orders and there you go, try it. You can easily get a sample off these. Like I said, AliExpress... <laughs> It's not like Alibaba because Alibaba shipping is through the roof. And I was telling um, my friend, I was like, I don't, to be honest, I don't like Alibaba because of course the shipping, the shipping is ridiculous and it's crazy. Like you want to sample that the shipping is, it's too much on Alibaba, but AliExpress, let me tell you, you products be two, three dollars, five dollars, ten dollars, twenty dollars, you know, stuff like that. Shipping be two dollars, three dollars, <laughs> but the cheap the the shipping is okay on AliExpress. So, like I said, you can do that. <coughs> another way, <coughs> another way to get vendors too, as well. Instagram, go on Instagram, type in, um. To be honest, you could do eyelashes, type in eyelashes, vendors, um, hair vendors, um, anything with vendors on that. You can find a vendor on Instagram. Look, everything is not a scam. Everything, to be honest, you have to spend money to make money. That, that, that motto, look, I can't even talk. That motto right there has like stuck in my head on like anything that I spend money on because I'm not going to say it's catchy, but if you get it, you, get, you know, you know, if you get it, you have, you have to spend money to make money. And how I put with that, I be like, look, these millionaires don't be, you know what I'm saying? Be like, Oh, I'm not spending money on that. Oh no. They spent money to get where they are today you know what i'm saying i'm not gonna say basketball players and all that you know because they just got the skills but you got these investors and you know <clears throat> realtors and all that. they spend money to make money right what you think you're doing for college right you spending money to what <laughs> make money for when you graduate you know when you graduate you start your career so spend money to make money Everybody think when you spend the money just to make some money, oh, it's a scam. Oh, it's a scam. The scam's going to I hate stuff like that. Like, even with stuff like with Forex, um, Forex was like a big thing these days. Everybody was like, oh, my God, it's a scam. It's a scam. The Forex, 
trading is not a scam but when they be wanting you to get into these groups and stuff then that's 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 the scam right there when you get into those groups or whatever that's a scam i'm not gonna say it's a scam because you're not learning anything or you're not trading or anything like that no but it's a scam because basically you're paying them every month to be in a group for you to learn stuff you get what i'm saying and there's so many videos you can click on and learn stuff from right all right so back there spend money to make money keep that in your head spend money to make money okay spend money to make money don't be scared to spend your last ten dollars twenty dollars a hundred dollars on something that's gonna bring you a billion dollars a million dollars or your first six figures right all right like I was saying, I was showing y'all products that I had. And that's okay. I was showing y'all products, like I said, stuff that you can start your business on. This is my this is my turmeric bar that I'm gonna be selling, right? <clears throat> this look, I have no makeup on, right? No makeup on. Wash your face with this. No dark spots, no nothing, right? Tumor bar. These are in style, like I said. These are in style, okay? Yummy bar. Oatmeal bar for the body, the skin. You can wash your body with this. Turmeric bar. You can do it under your arms, your face, whatever. Like, these are gems that you could do. Do you have to make these yourself? You can. You can make these yourself. Like, you can. But guess what? Let me help y'all on this. Or you can find somebody, a small business owner, right, who actually make these, right, and buy from them. You can buy from them. Like I said, spend money to make money, right? Okay? Find a small business owner who make these, who actually sell these, right? They have wholesale items. So they sell these as wholesale. You can buy these and you can start your business today. Don't tell y'all I'm not putting y'all on because these are, I just, I, I gave them, give me y'all business I need to do, right? <clears throat> gave y'all websites that you can use. Not only finding vendors on Instagram, go to Google. Find some vendors on Google. Let me tell you, let me tell y'all the trick. I spent money on buying <clears throat> vendors from other people. Guess what? I never used I think I probably only used one vendor for eyelashes. And I don't even think it even came from the vendor list that I even bought. So I wasted money on buying a vendor's list. I can share that with y'all. You feel me? But to me, I just think it's so stupid for people to be trying to sell vendor's list and stuff like that. You know, to help other people. Like, it's just like, y'all don't want to help y'all people out. Y'all don't want to help other people make money like i know y'all went through the ins and outs on finding a vendor and all that stuff or y'all probably bought a vendor vendors list from somebody or y'all probably did what i did went to alibaba or aliexpress and and got you a vendor or you know tried your vendor out now like i said i've tried these vendors out you feel me? i've tried these vendors out this is i love this vendor for eyelashes uh what I've tried this vendor out. I love this. I use this. I'm not going to say every day because, like I said, I don't break out. So, <laughs> uh, I don't use it every day, but I do use it, right? I use this. Love it. And to be honest, this got like a minty. <laughs> it has a minty feeling. I don't know. It makes you like, re like your body re renew like it, i don't know it's just like a minty feeling and at first when i first tried i was like oh like what you know but love it smells good this the oatmeal bar I, like i told y'all i don't use this because i don't have eczema my skin is is fine but i've used it on my nephew you don't have to use it just because of eczema but it does smell good so mm told y'all lip gloss right <sighs> come on now come on with it uh 
I'm not. I'm, just, I'm gonna stop showing y'all this because I got that wrapped up because it's leaking. It's leaking. Mine is leaking, but I have other ones that's not leaking. Um, like I told y'all, lashes. Oh, here's another one. Here's my clear lip gloss. Look at that clear lip gloss. It looks like nothing. I got hair on it. <laughs> clear lip gloss that I made. But, uh, yeah, so, <clears throat> clear lip gloss. You know what? It's because my hair stuck to the diamonds on this. But, crazy thing is, so I made this lip gloss, but I found a vendor who actually sells just the tubes. Got my logo on it. AK Collection. And, I'm trying to tell y'all, these vendors, it's easy to get a vendor. I'm not, look, I'm going to show y'all these vendors. You want to start a business started today. You want to start a YouTube started today. I've been gone for a minute, but now I'm, I'm about to be back. I'm going to keep posting and posting and posting, right? Um, another one, found the vendor for lip liner. Y'all know these lip liners are in style now. <sighs> right? Now, this one is just a, um, this one is just a little brown lip liner, but I think those are the most popular ones that people actually wear and uses. So that's the only one I got. But if people do want more colors, I will bring them. You like, but you can find vendors. Like I said, I found a vendor for this, but I made the lip gloss in this and put these in these tubes. I found a vendor for these tubes. <clears throat> I even found a vendor for the boxes. I have the lip gloss boxes because they didn't come with boxes or anything. So I found little boxes to put them in so, you know, you can hold them in there. But it is so many things to, you know, to find, to start a business. Another thing is when you start a business, Shopify. I love Shopify website. It's it's easy. And it's cheap. You can get like the first three months for like a dollar. Who finna beat that? Start your business today. Start your business today. Another thing you can do. If you do not want to touch the products. You can do drop shipping. If you do not want to touch the, the products, you can do drop shipping. Drop shipping is, like I said, make your website. You find the product you want to sell. Put the pictures and stuff on that website. And when people start making orders, it goes straight to the vendor. The vendor makes the orders, ship it out to the customer. You don't have to touch it. You just get the money, you pay the vendor, you keep your profit. You see how easy that is. <laughs> now, I'm not going to say it's easy, easy, easy. Because y'all going to be like, well, if it's so easy, why you haven't stopped? I'm not going to say it's so easy, it's easy. <clears throat> like I said, I'm still in the process of still getting stuff and all that. But I just gave y'all products that y'all can sell, right? Skin care, right? Makeup, right? Clothes, right? Clothes, like you can t take a picture in this dress, right? Which this dress is from Fashion Nova. You can take a picture in this dress or just get the dress picture off Fashion Nova. <clears throat> Put, um, Put it on, um, I feel like I got some of my nose, y'all. <laughs> All right. Put something on, um, put the picture, AliExpress, Alibaba, voila, vendors, 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 
go to Google, vendors, vendors, Instagram, vendors. And if y'all don't even want to go all in and out those vendors, those small businesses that y'all be selling, that y'all be buying products from, y'all can go and see if they have a um. Y'all can go and see if they have a um a wholesale. Wholesale is when you go and basically you purchase from them. You know, you purchase the products. You purchase products from them and they basically uh, give you maybe 10 of these bars for $36, right? You can sell them bars for $10. You can, that's $100. So you just made back the $6 that you just spent on these bars, but you just profited with $40. Money, right? You ain't even gotta sell it for ten dollars. You maybe sell it for fifteen. Fifteen look, fifteen times ten is what? This this is way like lip gloss. You know, profit. You are it's all about profit and how much you wanna sell it. Like I said, I got a vendor for the tubes. I made the lip gloss and then I bought the boxes. So to be honest, when selling lip gloss, depending, you can either get a vendor who actually sell the lip glosses, right? Who actually make the vegan, you know, all that lip glosses. So you can do that. Could be cheaper. I mean, make it yourself a cheaper too, because you know you got to think about the shipping. Or you can make it yourself, but you got to make sure you add all that prices in there. Like, ooh, I spent $50 on getting the products. To make the lip gloss. Ooh, I spent maybe fifty dollars on these tubes. Ooh, I spent another fifty dollars on them boxes. So the total I spent one fifty, right? So, hmm, you probably like, huh? How to make a profit off of lip glosses, right? Hmm. You could sell the lip glosses. Maybe we can see if you sell the lip glosses for fifteen dollars. You know, you can make your profit back, right? You sell a lot, you sell lip glosses for maybe, and that's just the averaging on if I did. To be honest, I gotta add that back up. I don't even think I spent that much on the, the stuff, but that's just in my head, that's off the top. I'm just giving me all just a number, right? But it's so many ways to start a business. You don't even have to do that. You can make digital products. And that's just gonna make, that's just gonna be profit, right? It's not gonna even be, ooh, you spending money to do this, ooh, you spend money to do that. No, digital products. You can go to Canva, go on Canva, make your little, a little calendar or a little planner, you know, something like that, something down the line, and that's just profit, right? And then you can share, like I said, do videos and pictures and do tips. TikTok. I just told my sister, I was like, TikTok is like a big thing these days to me. And apparently, I'm not going to say it's better than Instagram, but getting the views and getting the exposure wise, TikTok is better. But hey, but this is, the, like I said, this is a better way to start a business. So I just gave y'all ways with this. I gave y'all ways with this. <laughs> <laughs> I gave y'all ways, like I said, with vendors. I gave you guys, let's see, drop shipping. If you want to do drop shipping when you don't have to touch the products, I told you guys about that. Um, you guys, I told you guys about the digital planners. It's plenty, like I said, there's plenty of ways to start a business. Another thing I went across too, not too long ago. Um, just because you guys haven't heard that. But another thing I went across was um, YouTube automation too as well. Um, and I was like, what is, what is that? I mean, because it's the same thing as like posting a video, but I was doing research on that too. And I wouldn't advise to do that. Or if I do say you want to do YouTube automation, then like I said, you can find your own videos to make. Maybe like if you want to do rain or 
anything like that you know for like sleep you know people like to listen to rain and like water bars to go to sleep and stuff like that if you want to do rain and stuff you can make your own videos like that post them on youtube and do it every day get you some views and stuff that way right um not even just that other videos too like apparently you could it's a whole variety did i say that right right <laughs> <laughs> that don't even sound right <laughs> but it's a whole um <laughs> you know what i'm trying to say <laughs> but you can make videos of anything and just post them on youtube and like i said you don't even have to create them um somebody else can create them but apparently like I, i'm still doing my research on it because apparently they were like um basically I watched this one YouTube, they said they did it, but they had end up getting somebody who can create the video, find the information, edit the video and all that stuff. And they had to pay them. And then he posted the video. And I was just like, that's too much. And like, he spent too much on it. I'm still doing my research on it. But like I said, that's another way you guys can make money too. Just because if you guys do not post videos, you can do YouTube too. Post your own videos, vlog. That's another thing that people are starting to do, like take it to real thing. Another thing you guys can do is reels. Like, but that's not starting your own business, but those are business things that you can do, be an entrepreneur and an influencer and anything like that. Don't take it, you can take stuff from me, but like I said, I'm small time, so I'm just not getting out there. But though these are still like gems I wanted to like tell you guys on me getting out there. Cause these are just what I've ran into and I've encountered or anything. I mean, y'all can chime in and give you guys opinion too as well. And I can, you know, read those and take those opinions. But <sighs> I think y'all gonna do it. Y'all got it. Y'all gonna get it right. Yeah, I'm gonna get it right. But I'm trying to tell y'all, like. 2023 let's get it it's money to make all year it's free money out here let's get it okay you gotta what what did i tell y'all you gotta what spend money to what make money okay but this is gonna be the end of the video because look this video is getting too long but it's gonna be the end of the video and i'll see you guys later